Hi, this is Weekly Reflections, and I'm Nancy Joy, still coming to you from El Shaddai. <laughs> now, how long that'll go on? Thing by thing, my whole house is disappearing on me, and my beautiful plant behind me that's been with us on these videos for many years will be going to a friend also. So, anyway, I did want to say before I get going on May Day, which is Monday, tomorrow, um, that I'm going to be more infrequent with reflections, but I'm going to keep going. They won't always be on Monday, and that's been a tradition since August 2006. Many, 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 many Mondays. <laughs> I think of 400 and something. So I do it because I love it for me. But I want to get on to this, uh, the May Day um, discovery. <laughs> So I woke up in the night or early wee hours and I kept hearing this inner voice going, Mayday, 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 which, you know, is an international distress call. And boy, I've sure been through some distress. <laughs> so I thought, OK, now what? What's the next thing? Huh? Is the septic tank? Who knows? And anyway, I then realized that my Monday reflections, did I do one, if I did one, would be on Monday, May 1st, which is Mayday. And, you know, May Day, for me, has wonderful meanings. It, it's spring. It's the harbinger of rebirth. It's a reminder of children dancing color, with colorful ribbons around a maypole and all the beautiful May flowers of Beltane in, uh, with the ancients and still practiced today, too, where the many fires uh, all over the land and the, the couples um, going into the nature, to the woods, to make love, to create birth, to create the new, all so inspiring. And also it's a huge, uh, May Day is also a huge worker celebration. Actually, Labor Day came later. Originally, May Day came from protests somewhere of the workers and became a huge celebration worldwide. So there's a lot to May Day. So, self said, I better look this up. What's this May Day, May Day distress stuff? It's a wonderful day. It's a powerful day. It's a day of rebirth. And I found out that in World War I, there was a French man uh, who was, uh, had to do some of the airports and flying at the time, which at World War I, pretty rudimentary. And they wanted to create a worldwide stress signal for aviators and navigators, and he was tasked with that. Uh, I think his name was Mockford, yes. And he uh, came, he's French, so he came up with, and I'm going to say this wrong, Madier. And that came from Vene Madier, meaning come and help me in French. And somehow it was decided that that would be, it's, it sounds like Mayday, Madier, I'm sorry. I'm not getting it. And then I thought, well, of course, they're putting the reflection of the opposite in the positive. You know, um, it's a sign of distress. <laughs> so I, I felt somehow that I was supposed to talk about this today so powerfully, I wasn't even going to do a reflections. And I entitled it Mayday, 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 you know, as if, as if I am in stress and uh, distress and asking for help. And it just dawned on me as I was meditating and going to sit down and write this to you all to help celebrate in May Day, uh, to make my meandering short here, uh, I'm finding that we no longer need to divide um, the good and the bad of anything. Instead, we are here to integrate and to find the good in all we encounter by vibrating our ascended frequency. So my May Day alert is not necessarily distress, but rather... Uh, an integration point that everything is changing for all of us. I know for me in particular, but I don't care who I talk to, great change is afoot in personal lives and situations and certainly, of course, in Gaia and um, the political and uh, stuff going on on our planet. And so I'm putting out a May Day alert of my own today. May Day, May Day, May Day. Come and help me, right? Which is that um, Maier de, oh, Vene is Maier de. Come and help me celebrate spring, new beginnings, new life, our new earth. Let's all catch the magic of May 1st, 2017. Take a moment 
close your eyes and may they you know times they are changing it's very powerful so no matter what may unfold with that quote warning it's renewal in every sense i'm just feeling it so catch the magic with me this may day not sure exactly when i'll be back but please do stay in touch i love hearing from you i will be still doing my free sessions take care of who you are be well i love you bye